Buongiorno, very stick here on a very windy day. Welcome to Aquaviva. Aquaviva itself is, well, so it is a place. It's not, it's not a village or a hamlet. It's a collection of probably ex farmhouses. I think you can see uh, two or three of them there, just on the just that hilltop. Um, on, on a road coming out of the back of Rocca Spinovetti. Uh, but what a what a what a place. It's just a shame that it's a it's a bit windy today, can't put the drone up, but uh, you know if you're thinking about a holiday home or perhaps a permanent residence, somewhere like Rocca uh, sorry, somewhere like um Aquaviva would be absolutely perfect. And there's lots of uh, places I think you just see one there, not places for renovation. Very characterful place. So let's stop here at the side of the road. Lovely wild primrose look. And lovely to see. Beautiful colour. And going all the way up there look. And right down by the side of the road. Hmm. Really nice to see. Very pretty. Despite the blue sky above, it um, quite a few dark clouds coming in behind us. So I think you see in the distance there, that's another part of uh, Aquaviva. So it is quite spread out. It's got some lovely mountain views behind. Let's see if we can catch them before the rain catches us. If you like a reasonably out the way environment, you know, somewhere to live, this is, a, this is a place. Those houses you see there, I don't think they're lived in. It's a fabulous walking behind, right up to the top there. Wow. Just come across this old tree. I think it's something hanging in it to frighten the birds off, I guess. That looks at the blossom. It's probably an old apple tree. It's seen better days. <laughs> Still going though. Lovely. If you fancy a project, this is certainly for sale. Vendisi. Single story. <laughs> Great views behind. Got your own water pump. Just about see that. Actually, it's not single story when you come around the side. It's double story. Got power. You see them cables? I can. I don't know whether you pick them up on the camera. Great views to the side and the rear. Yeah. Nice find. And see a project. Getting windier as we speak, and darker. I'll uh, I'll come back. We intended to put the drone up today, but uh, I know the gentleman who's bought this. It's a bit of a project, but the views are going to be uh, spectacular when uh, when it's finished. And we got that to look at. Wow! So look what's over the edge here. or a garden down there. Rather nice. Certainly very characterful up this hill. Nice houses here as well. 
I say I think a lot of them are ex farmhouses or are farmhouses because they're really substantial. They've all got big garages or enclosed areas. You kind of get the feeling they've got tractors in there. Maybe not. <laughs> As I say, the intention was to put the drone up, but you're a little bit reliant on the weather, certainly when it gets a bit too windy. So we'll come back, put the drone up, and it, uh, when it settles down a wee bit, access to this looks a little bit restricted. <laughs> Again, that's probably, yeah, that's two stories at the back. You quite often find that, in fact, our house is, built into the side of a hill. It looks a single story property, but it's not. It's, uh, it's double story, twin story, I should say. But again, the views, wow, what a place. You know I said there wasn't a church? <laughs> well there is. It's right on top of the, the place itself. Unfortunately it's locked, understandably. Lovely little place. I'll try and find some information about it on Facebook. Or on the internet I should say and put it on the Facebook page. Don't forget Facebook that vario stick. Great view from out here though. Bit of blue sky as well. Come see Aquaviva. Beautiful place. Great views. Some great walks. Second mistake of the day. I said it wasn't open. Thank goodness for Mrs. Stick. A lovely little chapel. I suppose you'd call it a chapel. I don't know what the difference between a chapel and a church is, but very pretty place. Wind's really getting up now. <laughs> We've got a grand old house here, this yellow one on the corner. Nice. Nice terrace there with the views over the mountains, over the valley. Very lovely, lovely. I like the colour. It's the timber stalk. Keep me warm in the winter. With a vertical gardening as well. Hope you've enjoyed our little trip out to Aquaviva. If you have, please, uh, please like, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Feel free to share this as well, spread the good word about Southern Abruzzo uh, and in particular this time about Aquaviva. So until next time, this is Vario Stick saying ciao ciao for now. <laughs>